One of the newest cutting edge facilities on our campus is the Center for Human Nutrition Lipid Mass Spectrometry Lab. The lab is an open concept 2,000 square foot space designed for maximum flexibility. You can trace the history of mass spectrometry at UT Southwestern back to 2003. What this has allowed us to do over the years is to make forays uh, and discoveries in a wide variety of different fields in biomedical research. Currently we have about 16 mass spectrometers in the lab. The lab is equipped to handle at least 20, maybe more. Except for the fume hoods and the sinks, everything in the lab is movable. The newly constructed open concept lab with a modular design allows equipment to be relocated with minimal effort or disruption based on current needs. In the lab, we put in quick connects in the ceiling service panels and along the wall so that we can place instruments wherever they need to be without any restrictions. One of the things we designed specifically into this lab was a space for repair of instruments, either by us or by the engineers. We also have a series of other benches in the lab so people can come in if they need a space to do sample preparation and make it convenient for people across campus and those who have instruments in the lab to be able to make full use of this facility. Nitrogen gas is supplied by a 6,000 gallon liquid nitrogen dewer and vaporizer located adjacent to the building. Approximately two-thirds of the lab is currently dedicated to instrumentation, with the other third equipped with mobile benches for sample preparation. What our facility allows us to do is both collaborate externally and internally. We must get one request per week to collaborate, so it's a very popular facility because of its uniqueness. Although this lab was uh, built and is dedicated to the Center of Human Nutrition, we actually invited most of the other mass spectrometry instruments on South Campus to join us in this facility so that we could all be together. This includes biochemistry, preclinical pharmacology, pharmacology department, Touchstone Diabetes Center. This makes it a highly collaborative place where instead of having to go upstairs to another lab or across the street or to a different part of the campus, you can just turn to your neighbor and say, do you know how to do this or can you help me explain this? It makes these barriers even less than they already are on our campus. At UT Southwestern, we are continually developing new methods and implementing new software to improve results and expand our services. Our goal is to remain at the forefront of discovery and to bring about important educational opportunities and advanced treatment options for improved healthcare.